Hey everyone, Wags here from Eagle Dynamics, and today I want to talk a little bit about the throttle designator control, also called the TDC. And the TDC is actually located here on the uh, throttle by your index finger, and it has both slew functions for horizontal and vertical, as well as depress uh, designate function. And the biggest use of the TDC is to slew around cursors or seekers and uh, other things that your heart desires. And We'll take a look first here at the uh, controls, and we'll see how this is set up. So go to the Hornet, we'll come down to Axes, and scrolling down, we have entries for both uh, TDC Vertical and TDC Horizontal. So if we select the uh, Vertical, and we go to Axes Tune, we can see that we can set up a dead zone, we can set up uh, uh, X and Y saturations or curvature, and particularly for the Vertical, you want to uh, set it to Invert so you have uh, proper, uh, proper vertical movement. And coming back out, we'll go to horizontal, tune, and we see that most of these are duplicated, uh, except the invert is not set up. But if you don't have, say, like a mini stick or uh, something like that, you can uh, come down to the HOTAS category and scroll down. Then we have uh, uh, TDC to press, down, left, right, up, where you can assign these to uh, different keyboard keys or map those directly to a uh, hat switch on your stick and throttle. And coming back out. So the important thing is that the TDC can only be assigned to one display at a time, whether it's your left or right DDI, the HUD, or the MPCD. So for example, right now I have the uh, radar up here on my right DDI, but if I'm you know, slewing or trying to slew the TDC right now, uh, the cursor here, but it's not working because I don't have the TDC assigned to the right DDI yet. So to do so, what I'll do is I'll go uh, right on the sensor control switch, which is actually located right here on the real stick. And when I do that, we now have a diamond up in the top right corner, and now I can go ahead and slew my cursor using TDC control. Now, coming back out, let's go look at the options again, and the controls. So again, Hornet, we'll go to the uh, HOTAS category again. And coming down, we have a sensor control switch for F, for left and right, which again, you can assign these to any keyboard uh, uh, key or directly to your joystick or throttle. But let's say um, instead, I want to bring up a Maverick on the left EDI and slew that seeker with the TDC. So to do that, I'll simply uh, bring up the Maverick format page. Ooh, what's that harm doing there? And so right now when I use the uh, uh, TDC, it's still moving the radar uh, cursor because again, I have it uh, TDC assigned to the right TDI. But if I go ahead and go left on the sensor uh, control switch, uh, boom, I got a uh, diamond here on the left TDI and now I can go ahead and slew. Uh, a third option is assigning the TDC to your HUD. So to do that, uh, look, look at an example here of bringing up a uh, Mark 83, we'll bring it into auto mode, and now what I'll do is I'll go ahead and I'll push a forward uh, up on the sensor control switch. And when I did that, I now have a diamond in my velocity vector indicating that TDC is now assigned to the HUD. So now if I go ahead and uh, uh, TDC press, I can move the uh, cursor on the HUD around using the TDC switch. And later on, there'll be some uh, examples where you can go down on the sensor con control switch to the MPCD and assign it to the uh, uh, there and allow you to move cursors around, I think, in the actually the uh, SA page. So anyhow, folks, that's a little uh, look at basic functionality of the TDC in the game. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Thanks.